welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be my first update for Nightmare on Panic Street Project Pan. This project was created by my friend Valerie. I will have her Instagram page or handle in the description box um, and by Jaylon. I will have Jaylon's uh, channel in the description box as well. Go ahead and check them out. Um, I'm here. I'm doing my update. I'm super excited for this one. I'm always like, ah, am I going to be able to film the update in time? But here we are. We're doing it. This is a year long rolling project pan. Um, I had uh, selected to start with six products. Um, and then uh, all of products are, or all of the prompts are based on uh, Halloween scary movies. So the project started on October 31st of 2021 and it ends on October 31st, 2022. I do hope to get through all 40 prompts. Really slow with it, but here we are. Um, I guess I could keep this project. I think you could keep this project going if you really want to finish all 40 prompts. Anyway, let's go ahead and talk about the products that I had started with. I'll show you my progress or I'll tell you about my progress. And then uh, I'll tell you about the product that I'm rolling in or I have rolled in and I have started using. Um, okay, let me go ahead and pull my sheet out. I had started, okay, the first one, the first item I had, uh, was based on the movie A Nightmare on Elm Street, which was the way that Jelan and Valerie had uh, uh, translated that. They said, it's a dupe for an item you dream about purchasing. Um, and for me, I had pulled in the Elf Jelly Pop Dew Primer. Uh, my goal was to use this guy 10 times. So far, I've only used it four times. Oh, I know. Um, in, um, in one month, only four times. I... Yeah, I have no excuses, but yeah, I there's I need six more uses on this guy. I actually do really enjoy it, so it's not like a chore to use. It's just making the time to use it. Um, the second one is the Omen uh, 666. Use six pans in a palette six times. Um, I am working on the Hourglass face palette. Here's my face palette. Um, this is the Ambient Lighting Edit Unlocked. Um, so six pans in here, six uses each. I've used most of them. Let's see, I've used powder number one, which would be this one, four times. I use this guy five times, five times, five times, four times, and five times. So there's a couple products in here that I still need to use twice. Most of them just once. Um, once I hit my goal on using all of these six times, I'm going to go ahead and roll something else in its place and then I'll start using it. We'll talk about it next update. Um, my third item was for the movie The Thing, an item that you're not sure how to use. For me, I rolled in this bad boy. This is Becca Skin Love Glow Elixir Glowing Glow Nectar Brightening Hydra, Hydra Complex. I hate it. My goal was to use it 10 times and see how I feel about it. I hate it. I'm gonna go ahead and declutter this one. And I told you guys um, when I pulled it into the project, this will be like the perfect time to actually use this guy. See if I enjoy it. See how can I use it that would fit my routine and like my, whether it's skincare or makeup. Um, I tried it as a primer, did not go so well. I tried it as a serum, did not go so well. It, it pills, it pills badly, especially with certain products. So I have to be like very careful. And like, I didn't feel like it does anything. I'm gonna go ahead and declutter this thing. I did use it 10 times. Um, I made some progress in it, but it's not worth me trying to use it up. I'm gonna declutter it. Um, once I hit my 10 uses, I rolled in for another project, like another pro um, project. And where was it? Okay, and the one that I rolled in for was the movie Christine, which is an item that you made a special trip to the store to purchase. Mm. And that one is CoverGirl Clean Fresh. The Clean Fresh Powder. Oh, let me show you the packaging. So the Clean Fresh Powder, everybody was raving about this. It was sold out at Ulta and Ulta didn't have all the shades. So I did go to Walmart <laughs> to pick this guy up. Um, I have it in two shades. I have the shade 110, which is porcelain, and I have the shade 120 fair. Um, I do like porcelain for under my eye and that's the one that I'm gonna use. I do wanna use it 10 times. I've already used it once. Um, I haven't been wearing makeup, so I have no, you know, that's, anyway, nine more uses in this guy. Um, I do really like it. I like how fine it is and like, I, I enjoy it. So I do want to go ahead and use it nine more times. Um, okay. Next up we have, uh, the movie Us. 
an item that is a dupe. And for that, I am using uh, Musky Musk by Dossier. Uh, my goal is to hit like the bottom of where it says top notes. I'm very, very close, but I'm not there yet. So still going. I've used it a handful of times already or many times already. But yeah, I'm still I'm very close to hitting my goal, but not there yet. So it's going to keep going. It smells amazing. I do really enjoy that perfume. Um, next, I have Fright Night, a red item or something vampire theme. Um, for me, I am using the Pat McGrath uh, lipstick in the shade Elson because um, Valerie and Jaylon had said maybe you could use a bite like bite beauty item but i went with red um yeah i'm using this guy and my goal was to finish it i've made some good progress on it i'm really really close i think i can finish it this uh upcoming month um i just really need to use it i haven't been able to use it i use it a lot when i first rolled it into the project but this past week my lips have been dying i can't wear any lip product i'm wearing one today Right after filming, I'm going to go ahead, take it off and apply it to clear balm. It's, it's, my lips have been so chapped, so painful. I have not been able to wear color, but I wanted to do it today. I put makeup on, I'm filming, I'm going to do it. Um, next we have the movie seven, an item that's still in its box packaging. Um, it was in its box packaging when I rolled it into the project, but it no longer is. I'm like, I'm trying to see, can I see through this guy so I can mark it? I have maybe like a third left um this is the uh the professional super setter by benefit my goal is to finish this guy i'm i'm pretty close i didn't finish it yet but i'm pretty close so once i finish it i'm gonna go ahead and roll something else in its place i'm close i feel like i'm close on three for sure like i will hit my goal before the next update like the hourglass palette um the benefit super setter the perfume as soon as i finish these or i hit my goal i will roll in something else and then i'll tell you about it next update this is it i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please make sure to go ahead and give it a big thumbs up please subscribe to my channel before you leave thank you so much for watching i'll see you guys in the next one Bye.